All right, Niall Ennis, back pre-season, I think a week in. Um, I'm guessing it's been a lot of running, but just tell us what, what it's been like being back at, at home park and back at Plymouth Argyle. Yeah, it's just good to be back like home. I had a brief off-season, but it's just good to be amongst my teammates and the staff again like, and just get ready for a big season. This is your first pre-season at Argyle, having joined in, in January. How does it compare to other ones that you've you've been put through in the past? Uh, well, I got the heads up before the end of the season that it was going to be really tough, but we, it, the tougher you put the work in, the, the better rewards you get from it. So we're doing a lot of hard work, but it'll get us fitter and stronger. So, nah, it's, it's a benefit for me, so it's good. And it's not just running. I saw you, you went boxing the other day. Um, who was your sparring partner? Who were you up against? Um, I wasn't up against anyone, to be fair. But like uh, me and Ryan, we was doing we was doing circuits. So one was doing like let's say squats or uh, burpees, and the other was on the uh, the what's it called punching bag. So now it was a good day, to be fair. My shoulder's still in pain now. Have you have you ever done anything like that before? Uh, not really, like properly. So my, my technique was a bit weird. Like my shoulder's <laughs> killing, but now it's good to do that something different. How how important is it to? to kind of keep the interest going to do something like that you know not just out on the training field or in the gym to do something a little bit different yeah with me like um so like if i got told to do like a 30 minute run or whatever like it's just boring isn't it where when you're doing different kind of stuff like it gets your brain working and it just it's enjoyable as well i know it's tough but you, you get something out of it like it's fun like I, you don't really think in football you'll be doing a Boxing like day, but no, it was good. It's, it's uh, fitness, isn't it? So it's good. Yeah. Matt Shoulder might have to get, you know, if you do another session, <laughs> build the strength up a bit there. No, yeah. um, pre season games coming up, the first one's this weekend. Yeah. Um, does that feel as if it's kind of becoming a little bit more real? You know, the, the matches are coming as well as, you know, all the, all the training stuff? Yeah, definitely. Like, um, I think it's better that the game's quick because as soon as you get the games going, there's no fitness that's compared to match fitness when you're actually playing in the matches. So when you're getting the matches going, that's when everyone, you start to realise it's proper now. You you get a chance to get goals, to get results and stuff like that. And um, obviously the fans are there as well. So it's time to play in front of fans who I've not seen and they've not seen me in person as well. So it should be good. I have to ask you about that. Yeah, so since you've been at Argyle, there hasn't been a single game where there have been supporters. So... I don't know whether anyone's told you about this fixture against Plymouth Parkway. Yeah. Um, it generates quite a lot of interest and it can hold quite a few fans at their ground. Yeah. I think it's already sold out as well. I've seen so. that. It was sold out um, before I before we even came back mm. to start pre-season, which is good. Shows that the fans want to see the team and like, hopefully we put on a good show and get a win. And a goal for you? Definitely, yeah. That's, <laughs> obviously, I'm, I want to get goals, so yeah. That's yeah, you're running. Brilliant, Niall. Thank you very much. Yeah, it's fine. See ya.